Hi, Jen. How are you today? Hello. Can you hear me? Yes, I can hear you. Can you hear me clearly? Yes. How are you? I'm good. Um, you know, the news today um gave me <gasps> a bit, I kind of knew it was coming, but at the same time, you know, I was a bit hopeful because the numbers were slowly like trickling down. Oh yeah. Yeah. What about you? How are you doing? Uh, we kind of predicted it as well because, you know, uh it wasn't too positive. But you know when you hear the news it was still overwhelming when it's verified and you heard it from the prime minister right so i was like no <laughs> yeah. Yeah. how have you been throughout this whole experience um just to begin with i think people who draw we are kind of like home bodies but it's different I I like staying at at home as you know that my studio is also my home so I'm lucky to still do work here but it's different when you have to restrict yourself just from going out and you know try to uh not contacting like I mean not in touch with everyone else like physically so that was hard and I think it hit me probably last week like I've been cooking for a month and I know you've been working out for 2 months so this was crazy we learned a lot of new things but it's time to really you know this has to stop it doesn't have have to be that way and we really have to do this together yeah exactly i really feel you know being at, all we got to do is just stay at home so it is there there are dangers to not staying active or learning new things because your brain will start to shut down And True. you know, once the MCO is lifted, you want to be prepared. You want to be able to spring up and alive again. So that's why I decided to have this session with you, so that we can learn from each other. Uh, in this case, I'll be learning from you. We will all be learning from you how to do some doodling. So let's just have a little overview before we start. So um, okay, why I really wanted to do this, I think I shared with you guys earlier, is because I oh, I want to show you. Remember? Yes, of course. I saw it on the piano. Yeah. When when you were always working out and and doing live stream. So nice. Thank you. Those of you who don't know Lindsay gifted this to me. Uh, this is the notebook that I really love. I actually write all my my lyrics here. I want to show you my lyrics. Oh, that's so nice. So as you can see my hand I think it's not very nice lah. But Uh, I think that maybe right now, even though my hand I think is not nice, if I can doodle, I will beautify my page even more, right? So um, yes. that, that's why I thought it'd be really fun to learn how to do that header, draw all the flower, flower and the leaf stuff. So uh, I'm going to show you what I've prepared. I'm going to switch it over right now. All right, sure. Let's switch it. Okay, I have it now. Guys, can you tell me if you can see this clearly? In the comment section, I'm sure you'll let me know. All right, I'm switching over as well. Okay. I want to show you guys my this is literally my all this is my my um my lyrics. So you can so see nice. it. That's so nice to know. <laughs> I couldn't really tell what uh, the words, the exact words are, but the, those are your lyrics, right, Jen? Yeah, my lyrics. That's right. That's so nice. Is this too zoomed? Is this okay? Um. Very. Someone says your screen a bit blur, Jen. I think. Okay. Is no worries. It... I'll switch it back. Um, oh okay. Now I'm going to put um the phone on this other stand here. But in the meantime, why don't you walk us through? Okay, sure. Let me just adjust quickly as well. And uh, hello everyone. So today we are doing a bit of doodling here, and uh, Jen and I thought that it would be nice if we could, you know, just. Have fun drawing something really simple and um, what everyone can do, which is doodling. And you could always uh, 
put this into you know your notebook your homework your assignment or even just for fun so this is something that is very therapeutic and um uh, it it really passes time really fast so probably everyone can uh do it together with us all you need is just a piece of paper here like this just a white piece of paper that doesn't uh that is just thick enough and good enough and pencil eraser if you have but if you're confident enough you could just skip the pencil and eraser and you can have um ink pen will do so any ink pen will do like um those that you use it in your for your school or office like this or if you have sharpie like this one which i have here this is good as well okay what do you have jen i only got one pen that's it i want to okay. keep it simple because i'm not an artist so i'm right. going to keep it real and if i have All to right. color it in, i'll color it in Oh, John just gave me a pencil. Wow, I've upgraded. <laughs> okay, great. Thank you, John. <laughs> All right, let's start. What shall we do every time? Have you ever done any doodling before, Jen? Like um, in terms of doodling, I know how to draw. You see this? This is a heart mm -hmm. shape. <laughs> okay. okay. That's all. I know okay. how to draw this. <laughs> okay, great. So what we're going to learn today is uh, we're going to do some simple like banners. Mm. Okay, I did I did a sample of it here like banners. This twisting banner here and also uh we're going to stick to the theme of leaves and foliage here okay mm -hmm. so this is something that everyone could learn and definitely we could all do well with so uh probably from the very beginning we could th think of the the phrase or even a, just a word that we want to write first probably we could start with something simple like love okay. and things that you you've been telling yourself like how do you Uh, get through this period of time what do you need uh, mentally and then you write it out physically like this this is actually a re really helpful reminder when you flip op op you flip over your you flip your notebook and always read it again and again right this is something that will instill into your your mental as well so this is really good for mental health I I actually have like to do list every single day, so maybe mm -hmm. uh for me what I will do is I'll put like to do, mm -hmm. and then see how I can just draw around it. Cause you know it's kind of fun when I'm sitting down having my coffee in the morning. Yep. Mm. Let's do, let's try with um to do first. Yeah. You could just start um directly with the ink pen, or if not, then you could um I mean for those who are not confident now, you could use the pencil. It's perfectly fine. Oh, Marianne is here. Hi. Someone says my screen is dark. Okay, let me try to adjust it brighter. Okay. Now, those of you who just join us, you don't know what's happening. Well, Lindsay fixed the lighting. Just want to tell you, we are having a little doodle session with Lindsay. We're learning how to draw um something like this. <laughs> <laughs> Clearly, I need help. <laughs> okay. The easiest thing to start with is just the stem. All right. So probably just something like this. Okay. I think what you what you're doing is correct. And all we need is just add some little oval leaves. Oval leaves, okay. Yeah, on the stem. Yeah. Oh. oh. Is it yeah, like Yes, correct. Very good. You're a pro. Yeah. I feel like they're just more like circles than anything. <laughs> Ah. Mm, okay. Okay. And usually for banners or things that we want to frame it, right? Pretty simple is that we duplicate this 
element. Mm-hmm. Okay, we we'll call it vector element, and you can put it like just opposite here. Oh, the so same. So you have shape? something that is yes, you have something that is repetitive here, and it's easy to do like a composition like that. So you just repeat the same oh. thing, and um, you just the balik the the leaf stem, so the leaf stem. So you start from here. Okay, I just turn this side. <laughs> okay. <laughs> cheating, cheating a bit. No, no, no. That's good. That's a different way of um drawing. There's no right or wrong, really. Okay. I really like it. It's so pretty. It's so easy. Okay, so something yes. like this, lah. Yes, you're doing good. Oh, Marian says we should write our name on the paper so we know who is who. Do oh, you want to write oh, your yeah. name first? Then? Yep. Hi, I'm Jen. <laughs> <laughs> yes. Oh, also got the thing. Okay, I'll do that thing. Yeah, oh, the bubble thing. <laughs> okay, then let's continue with the to-do. All right, mm-hmm. so the easiest way is um, now that we already have some sort of the frame, right? Then you could mm. write or calligraph the words inside here. Oh, I think after this, right? Next week we need to have a calligraphy lesson with you. But right now, I'll just write my own word, lah. Okay, to do. Ah. Yeah, no worries, no worries. Let me just uh do like the the usual word as well. Okay, to do. Ting ting. Yep, great. Okay. <laughs> Someone say you're a natural okay. then. Thank you. <laughs> you're good, you're good. So if you want to, you know, like frame it even more, then you mm-hmm. could probably add something here or you could just leave it that way. Like um, if you want to add more leaf element, then it's fine. You could just mm-hmm. add here and here. But if let's say you want to do like, because we have something curvy here, we mm-hmm. could balance it out with something more constructive. So you mm-hmm. could do like a half square. So it's like more minimal, you know, like very, oh. very contemporary Atas design like that. I like Atas design. Oh my God, guys. Oh my. You like Atas design, yeah. I, I like, know your I like, Although I'm not Atas, but I like Atas design. Oh my gosh. Okay, <laughs> this is a very good tip, guys. So, those of you uh, like me, newbie, right? Um, whenever there's like some kind of natural curve, um, not perfect kind of drawing, you put something that's structured and something a little bit more like hard, so to speak. I think it has more interesting look to it. I think it looks really good. I think yours look better, but never mind. I continue. <laughs> no, no, you're doing good. And another tip is, um, if you're still not confident with straight lines, then you could always like a bit chit chit lah. Yeah, you, you just do it again so that it kind of distracts the, it kind of distracts the attention that it is not straight, but it doesn't have to be perfect. Yeah. Oh my yeah, god, that's, that's a good tip. Yes, and I then love- you can also add like some dots here and there around the leaves so that it looks more like fairy, like very feminine and fun fun the shui shui the like that. <laughs> <laughs> oh my gosh, guys, I really love this. Okay, those of you at home, if you did something, please remember you take picture, okay? Because we're all learning together. If you have something nicer than mine, please do take picture and share with me. Okay, so this is one simple one. I think I want to learn um, banners because I think mm. um, banners are a little bit more, I think, intricate. But I really like the mm. like that one. Right? And then... Okay. Let it, let it, let it. Don't know. Mm. Let it, let it. <laughs> okay. Sure. I call this like the, the, the classic Ang Mo banner. So, you know, they always, put it, they always put it under the... I don't know what, what you call it. The, the badge or the, the flag thing. Yeah, like the two lions down there got this, this, this banner, right? So, yeah. first thing is that uh, you will have to think what word you would like to put in because it also depends on the length. And mm-hmm. the length and the, the, the amount of the words. Yeah. And then, yeah, you can decide the length. So, what do you want to write, Jen? Why don't we ask our viewers, oh. what, what, what would you guys like us to write? Actually, yes. yeah. Why don't you let us know in the comment section right now? Uh, it's a word, it's a phrase, just share with us. 
Halo Chawon. Halo Jasmine. Hello everyone. Let us know what you want to write. Stay home. Someone say stay home. I love sing that. Sing. I love that. Okay, let's do let's that. That's a core. Right? Okay, so stay home. It's pretty simple. It's only just two words, so we will just do the two. How do I say it? Like the two line, two banner thing. Like it twisted okay. like a ribbon. So usually okay. I'll put this like the inverted S, something like that. Yeah. Inverted S, ah. But yeah. it must must it look like yours? No need, no need, no need. You don't okay. need to look like mine one. Yeah, you just do like S can now. Okay. Yes, something like that. Okay. Mm. Then uh you just connect like another you just connect another line down there beneath the the first line yes good and then you just put the ribbon the ribbon end like that the crisscross <laughs> <laughs> so cute you're too and nice then, like, uh, i'm not i'm not it's not cute i, I don't know okay all right got it so, no i eight. like your I like that because you are learning it and you still have the curiosity, you know. It's different. So you just connect and then here you just put the straight line. So it's like, yeah, you're doing good. You're doing good. <laughs> Yours even look natural. Are and you? so we are going to put the word inside here. Okay? Okay. Stay good. Like that. Oh, so okay. now you could, um, when you're done, you just use the Pen, uh, ink pen to write inside. Yeah. Hmm. Okay, I try. Can. John, you laughing at me or what? <laughs> yeah, Can John laugh laughing at me. Laugh? What this one? Lisa, <laughs> we're all learning, you know. You cannot laugh at me, okay? You tell John draw lah. Yeah. Lah. You you draw a stuff lah, yo. The British, ah, they all got all this thing. Ah. You ask him to know how to draw. <laughs> <laughs> oh my gosh, this is so much fun. I've always wanted to learn this. That's so nice. Thank you so much for doing this, you know. Seriously. Not at all. Because um, from my perspective is that... um. I I really love that you have you still have the first hand experience. I'm not sure if you you get what I mean. Like like my career, I've been doing this like since since a very young age. So I kind of do it very naturally. It's all it's almost like my instinct. So I don't have the sense of curiosity anymore. So I really I really like your you know like enthusiasm and all this thing. Oh, that's so sweet. Cause for me, it's like mm-hmm. I've always loved drawing, but I can't mm-hmm. draw. I only like to like see people draw. And I've always found it really amazing. And mm-hmm. right now, you know, being able to learn something, this new skill from you, I feel like I never knew that it was just like this two S's, and then you just mm-hmm. connect it. I mean, it's not <laughs> okay. very pretty, but you know, mm-hmm. it's practice. It's practice. Yeah. No, you're doing good. So usually they will put another shadow down there, which you have just. I mean, yeah, did it I did it instinctively. Yeah, that's good. <laughs> Wait, someone say Lindsay hand is so smooth. Yeah, it is so smooth. <laughs> Thank you. He's been doing so it for the young. shadow. For the shadow, uh, mm. you can do it black, or you could do this. You know, like the slanted line. Oh my god, yours is so much better. Let me try. So, Let me double it, see what happens. Yeah, I just want to give you more options so that you know what you can. You have the variety to, to choose. I love it. Jen's one reminds me of Harry Potter House's banners. <laughs> That's <laughs> nice. <laughs> try I love your audience. We all need to learn new things. We need to try new stuff, you know? Okay, something like that lah. We try lah, guys. Okay? Okay, yeah. this out of 10, what would you give me? I think I'll give myself a 6. Yeah, you're good. I want to give you a 7. <laughs> wow, 7. But I give myself 10 out of 10 for effort. Yeah! <laughs> <laughs> oh my gosh, this is so much fun. What else? What else? 
can we learn, Lindsay? What else do you think that, like, it's doable, but it's not too crazy either? Not too crazy either. Okay, probably let's do a circle. A Shall circle. we do that? Mm. A circle, wow. Okay, can, can, can. <laughs> <laughs> because a, a lot of people are paranoid, like, when it comes to doing circle. But I just want to prove that it is as easy as a square. Okay. Mm-hmm. Wait, someone what said do, do floral doodle. Do you think the circle we can oh. add floral element to? Yeah, sure. We can awesome. add oh okay. We can add around here. Okay. If it's not too overwhelming, we could add some more below here. So it's oh, like no, I, I meant for like the circle later. Oh the circle. Okay, let's yeah. continue that. Awesome. Okay, let's uh what shall we write everyone? Yeah. Please comment right now. What what sh what do you want to see? What phrase or what word did that you want us to write? I really love your last video, the the prime minister announcement. <laughs> this is, that was exactly how everyone feels. Thank you, Jen. Yeah. Oh my God, it's it is the so truth. Funny. I only speak the truth. Okay, someone said food quotes Netflix, huh? Do you want a long, long one or a short, short one? Um, it doesn't matter. Just one word is okay. Ooh, I like this. Oh. The gorgeous Taurus said, um, gratitude. I really like that. Okay, let's do that. Wow. Ooh. Okay, let's do a floral wreath, maybe. So we could, um, gratitude, right? Wow, that, that's a really long word. Oh, you want shorter word? Okay, you know to be no, safe. No, no, it's okay. Shorter word. You sure? It's okay. Let's challenge. Yeah. Why okay, not? Okay, I love it. I love it. So we just spell out the word gratitude first. You could make it all ca all in caps or um all in like small letters. Oh, you are doing in a new page. That's that's nice. Yeah. You, you I really want to do it in the bullet journal way. Nice. <laughs> Okay, so I'm gonna do like all in caps. Okay. With yeah. Okay, I try. This is testing our spelling. Is it like a single T or a double T? Single Lie, T, I right? Yeah. I don't understand. Let's try gratitude. How spell, guys? Can you please teach me how to spell gratitude? I will be very grateful. <laughs> oh, it's, it's one T. So it's G R K. T I Yes U D E Yep There we go Gratitude Okay Thank you Thank you guys For helping me Spell gratitude I love you Thank you guys <laughs> Now we're gonna do Like half circle On both sides So that it is mm -hmm. easier As compared to Like a whole circle So okay. Just use this As a benchmark The, the first letter And the, the last letter then okay. you just do a half circle. Does it have yeah. to be perfect? No, it doesn't have to, you know. Like this, Chacha also can, yeah. Mine look like a hamburger. <laughs> oh okay. no, it's bringing me memories of Jared's hamburger. Lembu? Lembu? Lembu sakit lah, don't know what lah, yo. Okay, okay cool. I did yeah, somewhat okay. of a circle. Okay. Okay, then we could use the ink to repeat the words. Okay. The, the word gratitude. And then right. later on, we we'll move to the flowers and leaves. Okay. Gratitude. Oh my gosh. This is so much fun. Really? Yeah. <laughs> but honestly... When you're just focusing on one thing, you're just focusing on like outlining the word, it feels really, mm -hmm. really good because your brain is like not distracted by anything else. Yes. What I love about art is that you could always just go into your world and forget about the rest of the world for a while. Oh, yeah. yeah. So when you do this alone and you just switch... Just turn on the, the music that you like, right? Wow, it's mm. it's sweet at your own space. Yeah, you can just like vibe and then 
no one's looking you're just chilling and on your own i think this is like makeup for some people you know like they just sit down in front of a mm. mirror and just enjoy a little session of makeup yep all right nice thank nice. you that's good All right. So now we will put a lot of leaves around the half circle here. So let's mm-hmm. take like um the middle kind of like a benchmark. So all the leaves will grow out from here in some sort like okay. okay. So you just put some stems out like that. I want to do first then I do. <laughs> okay, can I don't know if it, if it will turn out nice that this is kind of like my way of doing it. Then you just put on the leaves, okay? okay. Then you put some with some leaves without the the stem, just like mm-hmm. that. Okay? And then you put some more some stems out again. So they are coming out from the One middle. Point. Yes, but okay. from both on the left and on the right, right as well. Okay. So, You are very shy. I don't know how to draw the leaves properly, so I'm just gonna turn it around. Yeah, that's a good good way of doing it. Yeah. Mhm. Okay. Do I have to draw the line in between? No need, right? Just just the middle no one. Need. Yeah, okay. it really depends on. on the, if it's okay. too small, then you can just skip the line. Got it. All right, and then I'll just keep growing the flower. Yes, just let it grow and grow and grow. Yeah, like gratitude, you have to let it grow from within. Yep. Okay. A bit chat-chat, but never mind. Okay. So continue. No, it's going well. How do you Where do I continue the all the okay. leaves? Okay, <laughs> sorry. Let me just flip it. So now you you have some leaves around here, right? So you just mm-hmm. go according your circle. You just add some more like short leaves without oh, stem okay. here. Okay. Yeah, so that it still mimics, uh, the circle. Mm-hmm. Yeah. Got it. You, you just have to stretch it, let it grow. Yeah. Yes. Correct. Correct. Okay. That's nice. Okay lah, not bad lah, not bad lah. We're almost there, we're almost there. Yeah. Okay, so I just keep going, going round and see how much I want. Yeah. The round, the circle doesn't have to be perfect. Got it. Yes, correct. And if let's say you feel like wow, too many leaves already, right? You can add mm. some of those berries so that it is easier Ooh. that you pull out the stem, and then you just add like little berries like that. Oh my god! I love that. Okay, that's easier to draw. Yeah. Than <laughs> so you just randomly put berries all around the reef. So just like just draw one dot, one dot at it. Yes. Okay. This is my favorite because it confirm look nice one. Cannot look ugly one. <laughs> <laughs> that's what we want. We want to confirm look nice. Okay. Yeah, yeah. confirm. Wow, eh, very nice. Eh, okay, yours is of course way better, but no, 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 I think for the first time, I'm not not too bad. So it's good. You're working like a pro. Yes. And it and the and the, they're literally growing. That's good. Yeah, I think it's more than enough already, Jen. <laughs> yes. <laughs> yeah. They're really growing abundantly, so we could work the same way at the bottom of the. The the reef here. If let's say you feel like I have too much already, like we should move on. You could mm. also do like the half circle thing, like what we did, like just the lines will do. It's 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 okay. Or if um, you wanna do, like, I wanna same. try. I wanna practice this one again. Okay, let's do it. Yeah, I love your spirit. I really love this so much. That's But good. My only problem is like I I. Don't know how to draw the leaves properly. I draw until very chacha, but like you see from afar, right? It doesn't matter. So it makes me feel like you know, in the end of the day, if you're so focused on one small thing, it 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 doesn't really matter in it at all. Yes, correct. One you tip is enjoy. Uh, one tip of doodling or drawing is that sometimes we focus too much at one point. It really becomes a bit too much. You mm. always have to, you know, when you work along the way, remember to stop and look at the whole picture rather yes. than just 
just being so focused on that one single single thing that's what i noticed because mm-hmm. for me it's like earlier i realized when i look at just the leaves itself wow really cannot make it man and then after that i realized hey actually if you just look from far far away it's not so bad lah yeah and also because um you know like people tend to be very judgmental towards like your own self so mm-hmm. actually for others right to me it looks really nice so it uh we we don't need to like uh be so harsh on us ourselves lah yeah we do, we do. i agree mm. oh my gosh it's so pretty hey, should we be drawing the dot 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 also or not yet yeah you should okay because that looks nice yeah i really like the dot 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 idea cuz it really yeah. makes things more like magical Yeah, dot dot always make things look feminine and floral and fluffy. <laughs> agree, agree. Yeah. Oh, those of you who don't know Limzy guys, um, while we're drawing this, just just chatting, Limzy is like the the person behind my Joe Malone London, um, stop motion video. It is this woman, her creation, her brain that made. You know that whole stop motion happens. So for me, it's like the fact that right now we're able to learn from the pro, the actual pro. We're very lucky. Thank you, Jen. We can't do this without you. Aww. And I feel like I'm, I'm, I'm so grateful for that opportunity. You know, like I don't feel like there would be another, another chance of doing that. Honestly, that no human mm. beings want to do it. Like in Malaysia, <laughs> nobody want to do it. Serious, serious. Yeah, for me, for honest, because it's a really crazy um project. You know, like so many hours, I fainted twice. You know, it's it it is not the easiest thing, but you know, when it came out, it is so freaking amazing. Yeah, it is. And once in a while, I will I will go back and and rewatch the video, and I feel right? like. Oh, Is that what what we have done? Yeah, I think that mm-hmm. one it it deserves a lot of. Like for me, the memory of it is just amazing. I really really Thank love you. it. Yeah, yeah. I savor every second of it. Like even though it's hell for that forty eight hours. <laughs> <laughs> But it really was worth it. And you know, when you take your time to do stuff like this, I feel like guys, I did a really good job. I'm so impressed. Yes, you did it so well. Yeah. Clap, 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 clap. Everyone clap for Jen, please. Oh wait, wait, don't it. If you don't clap for me, never mind. You know why? Because, okay. because I have my own clapping trap. Look, applause. <laughs> <laughs> oh, ta-da! Yay! I'm gonna erase. You have all the you have all the KFA background music. Yeah, yeah. Because nobody want to be here. Cannot be here, ma. So you just. And then what? Jen made a joke. <laughs> hey, I want to hear the wolf whistle. What's that? Whistle. Okay, let's see. Wolf whistle. Wow, Limzy, you're so sexy. Oh. <laughs> oh my gosh. <laughs> So, yeah, so this is our creation, guys. I think you guys, once you've done your drawing, you have to tag Lindsay. Have to tag us so we get to like share our experience as well. Uh, but my only issue is that mine is kind of like faded because my ink didn't dry properly. So make sure your ink dry properly first. But yeah, oh my god, uh-huh. what can we draw here? I feel like there's something that we can add on. What do you think we can add? Should we draw like the 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 thing you mentioned or? Oh, okay. Um, I think you could continue the, you know, like, you just draw the line. That's it to connect the line so that it's you know remember the minimal and mm-hmm. the the sophisticated. So you just add line here so that it completes the circle. Oh. Mm. Oh, wait, 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 cancel. Okay. So just draw the line. Yeah. Correct. What if I want to draw like rectangle? I want to try and see how it looks oh, like. Oh, okay, sure. Rectangle. That's so it's thing. like it's just like this. Yeah. That's a bit. <laughs> it's definitely doable. Yeah, I want to try. Okay, you could just do it with ink. 
It's so fun. Oh my gosh. I wish I could do this. Like, I wish the live stream lasts for like two hours. Let's just sit down here and learn from you. Guys, I don't mind. It's yeah. a free class, yeah, guys. Just to let you know, uh, normally uh, I'll make sure Limzy charges, okay? This is a free class for everybody. <laughs> yes, everyone. Usually I uh, have to pay for my workshop one. Uh. This wow, is free. This is wow. <laughs> This MCO deal, okay? <laughs> yeah. Only for this promo is only valid for Jen and her, her followers, yeah? Only yes, for and the promo code is stay at home. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. Nice. So this is what I, I, I want. Huh? Yeah, it looks like like it reminds me of an earth as well. It's very rounded yeah. and it fits the word gratitude perfectly. Yours is really, really cool. I like I like my this one because I wanted it to be like as if the word gratitude is popped out and then mm. like the difference is in, at the back. But yours, it just looks like an earth. Like gratitude, mm. it's, uh, it's so beautiful. I absolutely love it. Thank you. Oh, yes. Okay, I, I think we have time for one last one. Um, mm-hmm. Do you think is there's anything you want to try out that we've not seen? Why don't you show us um, the, the, the sample that you did earlier? Yeah, someone okay. asked, to sh- asked me to show the poster. What do you want to do, Jen? You probably could have a look. Let me scroll from the top. I, <laughs> I literally did everything. Yeah, oh my goodness. <laughs> I, I loved the I like the um the flags. Okay, let me just look continue scene first. The flag is nice. Yeah, I slowly, slowly, you know, like the subtitle or the credit. <laughs> <laughs> Guys, if you if there's anything you want to see as well, you just comment, okay? This is specially drawn by Lindsay. She literally today I told her, why don't we do like a sample? She literally took time just to draw this for us. So why yeah. don't you just Look at it. Which one you're vibing? Which one you're feeling? Let us know. Someone said, can you post this in your story? Yes, I will. Definitely. This is Lindsay's work. I will share her story. Yeah, flat and love so nice. Chan Wan say. <laughs> Thank you, Chan Wan. Love. I really like the, the, the banner. La. I feel like I really want to practice. This one? This one? Or which yeah. banner? This one. Uh. Uh, what else? Me, can I see the left side? Got some more. Got what? Oh, the left side. The left mm-hmm. side, not so much of banner. La. This is quite simple. This one definitely you can do it. Oh my god. Um, up there, you see the up there one? It says So I'm Jen. It's so pretty. I've never seen So I'm Jen look like that before. That's so cool. <laughs> yeah, this is the concept of like uh, minimal, contemporary, and a lot of far, far here, sophisticated. Mm-hmm. So minimal, but sophisticated. It's kind of like. Atas. Uh, yeah, and it's very doable and very durable too. So usually this type, right, you can even do it nicely and put it in like name cards, things like that, so yeah. that it looks good. Oh my god, that's a good idea. Wait, someone commented and said that, uh, do the heart shape. Where's the heart shape one? Oh, 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 oh. This one, is it? Guys, you want to do the heart shape one or what? Let us know. We'll do one. We have time for one more. That's it. The exclusive deal happens. One more. Uh, last last twenty minutes, and that's it, guys. Self love. Where's the self love one? Self love. Um. Uh, wow. This one. Uh, okay. You choose yeah. one. This one. This one level three, lah. Okay, we level three. Come on, last one. Really. Why do we level three? Let's do this. Okay. Let's do the level three one. Okay. Great. Okay. Okay, we will post it on stories. No worries, guys. Thank you so much. It means a lot. No, she will okay. post the stories only if you guys post on stories. Because we want oh. you to try it as well, guys. You have to try yes. it at home as well. You try it. Yes. Okay, this one will be the same. We just need to write down the word self-love first. But this one, probably we'll write it slightly larger. Okay. Larger. Okay. Yes. Self love. Okay. Got it. Okay. And we will need to block it. Like um, you have to repeat it so that it becomes like the three D one. Mm. Mm-hmm. 
So it's like the I love New York kind of font. Mm. Okay. Guys, we're doing level three right now, huh? Level three. <laughs> Jangan main main this more. Good. You're doing good. Thank you. All right. S. How do you do the S? Ah, S two lady. Just follow it. Is it? Yeah, you just repeat the snake. Okay now. Okay. Hmm. Nice. So cute. <laughs> I try, sis. I try. There we go. And F. Chamo okay. says this is level eight, three, seven, <laughs> four. <laughs> okay. Good, Jen. Well yeah. done. So the next step will be um because we have to put some leaves in front of the alphabet and some at the back. Okay, so mm -hmm. you can choose, um, like okay, probably we do one leaf that is in front of the alphabet. Like you uh -huh. just have to draw the the stem again, okay, mm -hmm. and then you have to overlap the leaf like that. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. So you imagine that the fallen leaves fall onto the words. <laughs> okay. Yes, good. Anything like that? Yes, maybe another one here, like um, right on top of the S beside here. So one more tweak or stem, then cover a bit like that. Mm. Yes. So the idea is to try to cover a bit of the words so you can have the like. Big... Got it. Yes. Like, you know, Chinese, they say ying ying yue yue like that. So must say ying ying yue yue. <laughs> like uh it's there, it's not there. Uh, oh you know? okay, okay, uh, okay, okay. Like when you do photo shoot, fallen leaves fall onto Jen's hair, then you know, some in front, some behind. Oh my own is more like the each was. You know, at home the dishes uh -huh. are yin yin yue yue because <laughs> I don't like to do it. <laughs> okay, don't see. <laughs> All right. <laughs> <laughs> okay, so we will put some leaves at the back of the alphabet as well. Okay, so you could just, uh, it's okay if you want to overlap, but just bear in mind that later we will draw out the alphabet first instead of the, the leaf. Or if let's say you're good enough, you know how to differentiate like the back and front, right? Then you just do and draw behind the leaf. <laughs> So this takes a lot of, like imagination as well, right? Yep. Like mm -hmm. um you need to have good sense of layering. Mm. And like the depth of feel. You Got know, it. like Photoshop, right? Yeah, you put the layer on top, then it will appear on top. If you put it below, then it will the it's the same concept. Got it. Hmm. Okay, something at it. One yes. more leaf in the middle. Oh, never mind, never mind. Don't take <laughs> Okay. Okay, then you can we can start uh with the ink pen. Mm -hmm. Alright, then uh you could start with somewhere that you're comfortable the comfy with, like probably I'll just start at the top. Okay. So just I'll remember that like mm, what comes first, then probably the leaf first. Mm. Then draw over it. Yes, correct. I continue. How are you guys doing at home? Are you able to follow and keep up? Are your words like fat, fat like mine, like this? <laughs> <laughs> In the end it's of the day, you know, it's your own. It's your own. It's identifiable because it's your own. 
Mm. Oh, this is nice. Even for me. <laughs> How have you been like mentally then? Um up and down sir. Uh. Go up, up and, and down. down. And I mm. think, you know, being at home um you learn a lot about yourself. I think for me mm-hmm. I learned that I thought that I like being at home, but I really like being out as well. So I learned mm-hmm. a lot about myself that I'm not I'm not such a homebound girl. Mhm. Uh-huh. Mm. So then I learned also that um if I don't keep my mind busy it's very dangerous. Mm-hmm. True. So I started doing research about um people who were quarantined last time during SARS. Mhm. And if you know they 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 were quarantined for what two weeks as well and some mm-hmm. of them because they are prone to depression. Mm-hmm. The effect can last for like what another two three years, so that's very dangerous. And I told myself I'll never, I'll never put myself through that. So that's why mm-hmm. I just, every single day I want to try my best to, you know, keep my brain active, go and work mm-hmm. out. Yeah, that that's me. Yeah, that's how I'm trying to cope with it. What about you? That's so inspiring to know. I, for me. I think it's um you know like I try to avoid the news sometime but mm. you can't avoid it forever because you you definitely have to be concerned of the world so I yeah. think I read this news about Italy and um like how underhand everyone was and how they couldn't like I don't I, I try not to make it so heavy here but anyway it really tear me down like Yeah. I didn't even know that a news like that and we are not there but because we are all humans we could feel it yeah. just by reading yeah. the article so it's overwhelming so as as also I try to make myself really busy and occupied so I draw a lot I also do a bit mm-hmm. of art and I cook a lot as well and yeah that's 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 the part that I learn about myself Too. What have and you also, cooked so far that you are surprised that you can do that's very good? Yeah, I I've never really cooked before like just simple maggi mee or like rice mm. that's it. So it I I really pushed the boundary. I guess everyone as well. Like I'm also inspired at how how disciplined you are to to really work out like your it's a it's your output like you need a need an outlet need an outlet to to let go of that energy right exactly cuz mm. we all we are not born to lie down and netflix and chill all the time you know we're born <laughs> to be active we're born to move so that's yes. why thought, that's the first thing i do in the morning i want to be able to move so True. yeah that's what i've drawn what do you think what else do i need to do that's so nice so cute yeah. okay <laughs> um other than leaves we could use the same method of the berries to break down the you know like the shapes here so you could oh. add larger berries like this mm-hmm. and then just connect like like oh my three God. yeah so it looks, this this kind of looks a bit like fall elements but it's okay you could just do anything mm. and then you just fill in all the blanks that you feel like okay i need to fill in just randomly everywhere i love it i think art is really it's really how you feel what matches your mood at that time yes have you like when you're happy do you think you can draw better or when you're sad you can draw better definitely when i'm in- I, when I'm in a good mood, when I'm happy, mm-hmm. yeah, and you will definitely produce really good works instead of like um, sad. But of course, we can't deny that um, being sad or emotional is is not an emotion. We have to admit that as well. So when you do when you do work or or create art when you are sad, um, mm. it it is powerful as well. Probably you could relate it with music too, like yeah. Yes. So I guess for all of us like like whether if if in performing arts, singing, music or even arts, 
it's all about like conveying that message and we want we just want to be real like we just don't want to be we just don't want like oh i'm only happy forever no but we we had we humans are vulnerable we could do this yeah. all the time we can do this when we are happy or sad or screaming or or what yeah yeah i think uh, for me personally i i used to be able to write only when i'm sad like i have a lot of breakup songs <laughs> <laughs> and then um i notice as years go by i really love writing when i'm happy i like to write funny songs you see so ever mm-hmm. since then i realized hey funny songs i can't write it when i'm sad mm-hmm. you know so that gives me another it gave me another avenue to just write fun stuff mm mm So you your direction you know somehow it changes as well along yeah. the way everyone has along the way transition. yeah along the way you rediscover yourself and i think okay. you know yes we are stuck for maybe another two more weeks or so um but it gives you an opportunity a chance for you to relearn and rediscover who you are so for me it's you know doing things like this being able to learn little little skills like this it makes me feel very happy Mm. True. Oh, I have an idea, Jen. Maybe I could give you a homework. <laughs> Woo! Oh my god, yes, please. Yes. Please um, you know, do a a banner like this for for probably all of your songs. Is that a bit too much or maybe just one or two of your song titles? <laughs> oh my gosh, yes. I think I can try. I can try. I can try. Yeah, let's do this and you can fill up on your in your in your notebook. Yeah. Okay, then you continue at a lot of dots and the the sparkly circle fill up the whole thing. Nice, very nice. Yes, <laughs> I think you're almost done too. I love it. We have another five more minutes, so I'm just going to do the finishing touches. And in the meantime, if you if you guys are interested, you have to follow Lindsay because she seriously is next level. Like she can teach a noob like me to draw like this. I'm sure <laughs> she can teach anyone. Okay, so, so good. my next my next mm-hmm. thing is I might just ask John and see if John <laughs> if John can do this or not. It'll be so interesting to see. Right? <laughs> Let's yeah. I want to see John. One, 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 one hour becomes senpai level. <laughs> <laughs> you know yeah. what? The next, the next week, since we have like more time, right? Next week we're going to see what I can do with Chang On. Maybe you do yes. some cooking challenge. Ah, uh, don't know what. I uh, will figure it out. Like next week, I I want to keep this theme going. Every single week, we want to learn something new. Okay, Good. that's what I want to do. I want to learn something new, with you guys, and I want to make sure we take make full use of this MCO. Whether it's working out, whether it's dancing. Oh yeah, tomorrow I'll be working out, and Sunday I'll be dancing, guys. Those of you who want to learn TikTok, ah, uh, what a viral TikTok dance dance move, ah, uh, Sunday, okay. Um, so we have four more minutes. Why don't we switch back the cam and we say our last goodbye? Sure. All right. We should do a print screen with the uh, with our work. Ha, ma ma one like that or can you me? Could you? Which one could you? Okay, I want okay, I tell you what, why don't why don't we hold up hold it up? I know it's yeah. sweet, but we just hold it up just those of you who are taking a photo for us, please take a screenshot for us. So that we can hold these memories together, okay? And if you are at home, please take a screenshot and send it as well. One, two, three. Yay! Perfect. Um, Lindsay, before I go, I just want to say thank you so much for being so cool and teaching us these simple but also incredibly important steps to doodling and making our art beautiful. And we want to say thank you so much. And of course. Studio audience, please make some noise for the one and only Love Limzy. <laughs> the one and only. Thank you. Got a lot of fans here. <laughs> yeah. Thank you, Jen. Always amazing, Jen. I hope you had an amazing uh, weekend. I hope that we could do this maybe next week or something, and we try something new together. Uh, in the meantime, please stay safe, stay home, and stay hydrated. Okay. You too. Goodbye. Love you Thank so you much. Bye, everyone. Bye, bye.